everyone. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to do a Ipsy Glam Bag unbagging. Now I did skip last month, um, but I did kind of forget to cancel it one more time since all this stuff is going on and, you know, money's a little tight <laughs> but it is here and I'm excited to see what's inside so uh, if you are interested in trying out Ipsy it is $10 a month I believe it will be going to $12 a month very soon if it hasn't already um, but you get five sample size products every once in a blue moon you will get a full size product um, such as a lippy or a brush and that's actually really exciting and I do feel that I get my money's worth from Ipsy um, so <laughs> Let's see what they have in store for us this month. Maybe. Okay. The bag. Oh, the bag is cute. Oh, it's so cute. Look at that. This is the bag for April. I love it. It's really, really sturdy. And this cute little wooden tab that says Ipsy. Oh, I adore it. Okay. Oh, I see some really nice goodies inside. All right, let's go ahead and bring out the card. So it says, Full Bloom, April 2020. Mother's Nature's finest work, you. <laughs> it's time to fully embrace your natural and most gorgeous state. Curls, curves, and all. And allow yourself to bloom. And then, of course, on the inside, it tells us all the products. So I'm not going to go through that just yet. I'm just going to go ahead and dive in. Um, the first item we have... It says nude shimmer and contour eyeshadow. So it looks like a little mini eyeshadow palette from Oriza or Beauty. I don't know. So this is a little compact here. And then it does have like the, uh, the colors on the outside. So it is a neutral palette. But I have a lot of palettes, you guys. And I don't think I need one, especially a mini one, because I do like kind of like 12, 14, 18 pan palettes. So that's really my my fun range. Um, so I feel like this would just get lost in my collection. And since it is wrapped up really nicely, I'm just going to go ahead and set this aside for my future giveaway. All right, the next item we have. Now, this was a choice item. I was able to choose this, and I am so excited. I have always wanted to try something from this brand. And I've never had the opportunity until I saw it available. So this is from Koki. Uh, this is the Be Bright Illuminating Concealer. Now I have no idea if this is going to be my shade or not. I hope I can use it because I would love to try their brand. So super, super excited for this. Um, let's go ahead and open it up. Let's see. Mm, maybe. I don't know. Mm, we'll see. I do like the little applicator on it. Um, that's not too bad. Hmm. Okay, I actually might be able to use that. So I'm really excited to test this out, you guys. Like, so excited. Okay, the next item we have is huge. What is this? <laughs> it says it's from Space Case Cosmetics never heard of them I've never even seen them in Ipsy before that's a cute little packaging though look at that isn't that cute oh I freaking love it okay it says it's vegan and cruelty free so what what in the world is this I would love to know oh wow what in the oh that's pretty okay so this looks like it is a highlighter yes it is a highlighter um this is what it looks like. Now, it does actually kind of remind me of ColourPop's highlighters. Look at that. Yeah, see? Yeah, definitely a similarity. But let's see how pretty this is. It's in the shade Seen from Space 1A. Hmm. Feels really nice. There's the shade right there. And then, ooh, that's pretty. Kind of like a gold champagne mix. That's really pretty. Okay, this is gonna definitely stay in my top drawer. I'm excited for this one. So the next item we have is from 
aromatic aromatica <laughs> it says this is a candle candula juicy cream all skin types sensitive skin vegan formula i have no idea what this is okay let's see an unscented lightweight vegan moisturizer containing hydrosol floral water foam Okay, I can't read the rest of this because, yeah, they're really long words that I've never heard before. All right, so this is a moisturizer. I'll have to give this a test out and we will see how that works out. And the last item is, we have really little spec. The last item we have is a matte lipstick. This is from Bella Pierre Cosmetics. Just very simple packaging, nothing over the top. And I'm assuming the shade is going to be similar to that, which actually makes me really, really excited um, because I do love a good nude or a peach. The packaging actually kind of reminds me of a little bit of like a Dior package, um, especially with the side. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know, something about that little design reminds me of that. Um, but it's cute. It's definitely cute. And yes, that is definitely the shade. Oh, that's a pretty shade, you guys. Look at that. Very pretty. No smell to it. That's good. Oh, this is my jam. Oh, I love it. I have nothing on but gloss. So let's see. Let's test this baby out. That is such a pretty shade. I am so in love with this, like for real. You guys, this is so pretty. Oh yes, I think that might be like one of the best things in the bag besides the Koki product. Okay, so let's go ahead and do a quick recap. I got the Koki concealer, which I'm super excited for. I chose. It seems like the color might actually work, so very, very happy with this. We got the highlighter, which is so pretty. I'm really excited for that. Um, we have the eyeshadow palette. Like I said, this is not a bad product. It's just I really think it would get lost in my collection, and I think it would do somebody else a little bit better good than me, so I'm going to go ahead and put that in the giveaway. Uh, we got the jelly um, moisturizer, which is, I've never tried a jelly moisturizer before, so that's going to be really exciting. And and we have the lipstick which oh my god I'm so in love with this color like this screams like springtime vibes to me it's a really nice nude it feels really creamy on the lips it, it just mmm I'm so happy with this Hey guys, so that is it for this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed it if you did please give it a big ol thumbs up for me and I'll see you guys next time bye